Hello, people of the world. My name is Mr. Tidy, number one agent at Blue River Patrol. Our goal at Blue River Patrol is to make sure our world is clean and tidy. Let me ask you one question. Do you pick up your trash during nutrition and lunch? Chances are, the answer is yes. But it doesn't mean you are lying. Let's use this scenario as an example. You finish your lunch. Do you throw your tray away, or do you leave it? Uh, I throw it away. Now, this is what someone would normally answer if they were asked this question. This is a photo of the hallway behind me before school, when nothing's littered. And this is what's seen after in this same hallway. Some people will say, oh, the janitor will pick it up. It's their job. Think about this. If you were the janitor and you saw everything that was behind me, would you want to do it? You'd probably think, oh, it's gross. You might even quit. Now let's look at statistics outside our school. Central headquarters. Here, we get statistics on littering across the world. According to our latest statistics, citizens in Los Angeles litter about 96,500 tons of waste, daily on average. Kilograms, that's the same weight as 965,000 pandas. Crazy to think about, right? Now let's look at the bigger picture. Now, littering does not only lead to a non tidy society, but it's also harmful to life. Example, many small animals crawl into bottles or jars, and they get stuck and they starve to death. That water bottle you litter on the pavement, it could have affected something that has a life too. Littering can also affect our beautiful oceans. In fact, 50% of pollution is left by litter that is left by us. And besides water and land pollution, it can also pollute our air. My job is not to focus on the negative effects of littering in our world, it's to help prevent littering going up. So now, let me do my job and tell you how we can prevent littering in our world. Step one, if you find a piece of trash on the ground or anywhere at all, pick it up. Step two, find a trash can nearby. For those that don't know, the proper English definition of a trash can in the dictionary, or a garbage can, is a container to dispose any waste. Huge lifesaver, you should try it sometimes. Step 3. Dispose your waste in the garbage container. And once you do this, all your garbage will be sent to a place where it's supposed to be, and not over our streets or around our school. Well, we're about to hit our film's time limit. So I hope you learned something about littering, and if you are that much, I hope you will now reconsider where you dispose of your trash. And remember, always treat the world the way you would want to be treated. Thank you, and adios.